Okay, item number six. Don't hire a grant writer. You hear me? Don't hire a grant writer. <laughs> Everybody say, well, there's so many people I talk to say, oh, where do I hire a grant writer? I need a grant writer. Uh, oh my gosh, I'm gonna do, they go on the internet, they're gonna see all these ads for grant writers that wanna sell you stuff that people, experts are gonna tell you who are grant writers are gonna tell you you need a grant writer. And it's another kind of fake news kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah, you do. You can make a case for that if you're going to apply for a huge grant application. But remember one of the earlier uh, don'ts I had is that don't ask for a grant. See, 80% of this money that's given out that you want to apply for is not even called grants. So that means no big application. It's just two or three, four pages at the most of just fill in the blanks. You don't need a grant writer. You know, that's the, this is the biggest sin, I think, that I've seen in people selling grant information because they want you to hire them. That's something else they could sell you. Oh, we got an airplane coming by. <laughs> that's something else they could sell you and that you don't need. And so never hire a grant writer. You may, there's a, you know, maybe a five or 10% chance you may, and, but don't do that until you see the application you want to apply for money for. It's a lot harder to find the right application than it is to find a grant writer. They're gonna find you, believe me. Uh, but you have to find the application. And believe me, 99% of the time, <laughs> you won't need it. Okay, so that other 1% of the time you do need a grant writer, that's fine, you, there's places to do it. You go to the Foundation Center. They, they have a, a good source for helping you find grant writers and stuff like that, legitimate people that do this for, for nonprofit organizations and the like like that. But remember, if you go out and hire a grant writer first and then go and find, start looking for a grant, to me, that's like buying a prom dress before you're invited to the prom. <laughs> <laughs> Who the hell would ever do that? You want to get invited to the prom first. Okay, you see the application. You see, oh God, you can't do this. It's too big. Then you investigate that. See, to me, hiring a grant writer before you know where you're going to apply is one of those things postponing the in in inevitable. And the inevitable and the hardest thing is finding the right place. So do that research first because it's easy to spend money. That's it. It's hard to find the right place. Uh, and, and that's the most important thing. All the rest is detail. You know, it's like running a business. Don't worry about anything except the most important thing. And the most important thing is getting a grant is where the hell are they? <laughs> Not how to fill out the application. That's a detail. So don't hire a grant writer.